Hello again, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. This is Captain Ron Phillips here. And uh, today we're back in Saint Denis here after Arthur got his um, unfortunate diagnosis here. We were going to join up with Sadie here, but on my way, first we uh, ran into the doctor. And now Brother Dorkins is here. I'm like, I wonder what, I wonder what Brother Dorkins is up to. Let's see what's going on here. Sister. Brother Dorkins and I were talking about you just the other day and hoping we would see you again. How is Brother Dorkins? Oh, he's quite well. A little frustrated with the workings of our order. He keeps trying to be sent overseas, you know, do something with more challenge, maybe uh, be a missionary. He's a lovely man. Sure. And how are you? Uh, never better. Are you sure? Uh, I'm quite sure, sister. You know, a long time ago, I was like you. I very much doubt that. Oh, no, I did terrible things, awful things. And I could not stop doing terrible things because I did not believe that goodness existed. And then one day, I saw that love did exist. And ever since then, doing bad things became, well, not impossible, but ridiculous. I guess I'm just hoping for a, a dignified exit. I shall pray for you. Oh, I'm not a religious man, sister. I'm an outlaw. <laughs> oh, what fun. Religion is just a word. Hearts are rarely pure, but equally they are rarely impure either. Well, that's an interesting way of putting it. To me, God is people and people are God, so we must all do what we can. These people are starving. Go find them some food. Don't worry so much about your heart. The actions will lead, and the heart follows. I'll still think of you in very nasty terms, as you wish. All right, you know what, sister? I've got some money on me right now. You can buy some food with this. Oh, you're so wonderful, Mr. Morgan. No, that ain't true. I meant wonderful, but so very frightening. Exactly. Consider your good deed done for the day. I won't subject you to any more benevolence. Sister Ethel makes a fabulous stew. They will be so happy. Well, anyway, I must focus on the work at hand. Goodbye, then. I have already taken up far too much of your time. Have okay. you anything to spare for the poor? Okay, that was a nice quick little um, do, chat with Sister Calderon. I thought Brother Dorkins was there. He's trying to be a missionary. So, okay. Nothing too hard, nothing too long, but... Uh, an important conversation to keep in mind ever uh, since though because it does impact Arthur and uh, his decision making from here on out uh, throughout chapter 6 so yeah I hope you enjoyed this little conversation he had with him uh, with uh, Sister Calderon and um, we'll be right back here we're gonna do Sadie up here um, yeah be right back guys I hope you enjoyed this little conversation Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and uh, I will be right back with the ever-ferocious Sadie Adler, and we are going to break Mr. Marston out of jail. So, see you guys later. Mm, see you guys later. Sorry. <laughs>